Hi folks, in today's video tutorial I am going to show you how to repair circular references or how to remove the circular refer references from the assembly but I will start from scratch so I will create the circular references first. So we will create new 3D model and will be D001 and I will create simple shape and will be for example rectangle something like this is okay it's fine I will create new assembly and with some name and we will apply the model from the session and will be default orientation over here we need to create some special shape so for example somebody will open the model and over here they will create some special shape something really easy so special shape can be like this yeah but what does it mean i do not use the dimension here yeah? so you can see that it will be better if i need to create the opposite 3d model here i like to reuse information from the assembly so directly in the assembly i will create new 3d model and will be b002 for example and i will use the copy from existing system will use the template and i will use the default placement great perfect and right now over here i will activate the 3d model and if i will activate the 3d model for example we would like to create a simple extrude feature and sketch plane i will select from the datum plane from the model b002 so everything is fine but over here you will reuse the existing geometry and this existing geometry for example will be like this so three edges are reused what does it mean the system will select these references as reference and if i will select for example the depth for example 55 doesn't matter we can confirm and right now if you will regenerate the assembly so i will activate with control 8 and i will regenerate control g you can see that nothing's happened it's not problem everything is fine and you can continue and this assembly was created for example by your colleague or colleague of you yeah and if you will check the working directory so if i will save this give me a second i will save this assembly you can see here that nothing is created no crc file is created and it's not error message here but this assembly was created by your colleague and then his, he will tell you please make some modification and you will say okay um, this component is not correctly placed it and you will specify it, the edit definition and you will change for example because you do not know how the object was created yeah and you will specify the placement for example you like it here so you will place where you want yeah so for example distance coincident and everything is fine you like it perfect so this is much better placement like was original one because it's suitable but then you will regenerate the assembly and the system will show you problematic problematic circular references but you didn't create this assembly before you only modify this component placement what does it mean if you will select the warning message or you will select the right mouse button information and reference viewer you can see that in the dependencies you can see the connection between parent children and if you will select the path and info and reference info the system will show you all necessary information if you ask me go through the path and if you have a for example five circular references it's unbelievable it's really hard so I'd like to show you how to do it much easy. If you will save the problematic assembly and confirm OK, the system will create for you always the CRC file. If the circular references exist, the CRC file is created. Open it, for example, with a notepad or wordpad, and then you can go through and investigate the problem. And over here, for example, it will be the five circular references. Please focus on the first one. Many, many times you will repair the first circular references and everything disappear because many times it's circulated each other. For example, you have placed components 
on this component. So what does it mean? If you will repair this component, everything will be repaired again. So fine. Over here, we need to understand that we, you have to looking for feature number six and component ID 48. So in the CREA, select the three columns, feature number, feature ID, and come from OK. In the model tree, the system will show you necessary information. So we are looking for number six. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is problematic model. Component ID 48, 48 is suitable. So my model is this one, problematic model. Because you can imagine that in the assembly will be 25 or 100 components, yeah? And feature, problematic feature is the number five, number five, feature ID 144 in the model B002 and it's extrude one. So this is the problematic object. What does it mean? I will open in separate window and I will investigate the extrude one. What does it mean if I will select the definition for extrude one? And if I will select references because this is the reference for the model and I can see that edges are took it from the D001, so not exactly from this model. And then what do you can do is simply to delete existing references. You can select the default a coordinate system or default planes as the references and if you will close the system will took dimension from this reference so shape is not changed everything is as original one and if you will come from ok and if you will come from ok and close the window you need to regenerate the assembly yeah because the system remember the original position and everything so if i will regenerate the assembly everything will jump back because this component has been placed, for example, default or surface to surface and so on. Yeah? So everything is back, it's working. And if I will open the folder, I will delete the old circular file. Yeah? And then I will regenerate assembly, I will save assembly in my working directory, CRC file doesn't exist. So right now we do not have a problem and circular references has been removed or repaired. And again, you can check the information reference viewer and over here will be no children which are connected to previous model. In this video tutorial, you have seen how it's possible to create circular reference. It was one example, it exists more, but it's always about uh, connection, placement, references. So please go through to CRC file, which has been explained in this video tutorial. And if you like this video tutorial, mark it as the like or buy me a coffee. Thank you and bye-bye. Vladimir. -bye.